hi guys welcome to this episode and this episode is it's really not a good one it's um we're really sad we're really heartbroken that um prophet bishui lost his daughter israela um even though we have our differences with the father um we won't wish death upon his daughter the girl is an innocent girl and um, yeah so today bushiri put out a press conference to talk about the death of his daughter israela yeah so let's just watch what he has to say it is of a great sadness that i announced to you the passing on of my daughter israela um, as a father, it was my desire to see her growing and living to fulfill the purpose that the Lord had called her for. Israela was born during the time when myself and my wife were going through a lot of persecution. She has grown knowing nothing but the labor and the fight and the pain as palace had been through in the course of saving God. And when she was born, we knew that there will be a time, just like another child, just like us and you, there will be a time when the Lord will call us unto glory. We preached to her in her young age and led her to Christ. Israel was not just a child, but she was someone who had given her life to Jesus Christ as her Lord and her personal Savior. Israel was a young girl who loved worship yeah. and serving God. It is important to notice that we as a church, uh, as well as parents, did our part. We prayed. We fasted, we declared, and sought God to saving her life. But we believe that God's will is sovereign, and we bow to his purpose and to his will. And we believe that the devil has no power over God's children. And we believe that this could not be the will of the devil, but it is the will of God. And we bow to that sovereignty of God and say, let his will be done. We are a church that believe in miracles, that believe in healing, and that believe yeah. that Jesus Christ is the healer. One asked me a question and said, do you still believe in God? And my answer was so simple. I will believe him even more after this. I, I will believe in, in him more than I've ever believed. I still believe that God he is the same God who was, who is, and who is to come. I believe as well that it is his will that we are alive and that one must not live a lot of years for him to know that God loves them. But it is about fulfilling what we were called for. Jesus died at the age of 33. He was so young. It was not about how old he died. But it was about he fulfilled what he had come on earth to do. Having said that, I'd like also to say I believe. Okay, with so all my Prophet Bishiri, we we are really sorry for what happened to you. Uh, the fact that we don't agree on many things you do does not mean we would wish death upon your family. And um, when this whole thing started, we thought that it was a ploy for you to run away from uh, Malawi uh, because of the way you usually are but um, now we kind of feel bad for you and um, no parent should have to ever bury their child no parent no matter how the parent is no matter how what you've done no parent should actually have to bury their child so we are sorry for your loss and uh, we pray God gives you the fortitude to 
bear this loss. Aboki, Aboki is not in the studio. He has um, he sent in a video. So listen to Aboki's video. Uh, I, don't, I, I don't know what to say right about now. Um, I just want to say to the family of uh, Abushir, we are very, very, we are very, very sorry for the loss of uh, your beautiful daughter. I know that uh, it's a very painful thing when you somebody lost a loved ones. Uh, we call it command spirit. I do not to put the wound unless you understand. We sympathize us uh, with you. I mean, our soul rest in perfect peace. Uh, may this not happen to your family again in Jesus' name. We prayed for. This is not what <clears throat> we wish for. Uh, so sorry. So sorry for the loss. So, people, you know that uh, this life is very, very short. Very, very short. Anybody can die at any time. Uh, our prayer is uh, may we not die young. Please, guys, I want us to be very considerate in this period of time. Yeah, we know Bushiri is not the nicest person in the world. Like I said, no parents should have to bury their child. So, please when we're dropping comments let's try to be nice let's try to be nice and um, let's try not to poke fun at the death of his daughter even though we have some of you have many grievances against him like some of you have lost your loved ones as a result of the money you lost and stuff like that so but um let's just try it's very christian of us to just leave so let's just try and just commiserate with him and and i hope this teaches him a lesson and teaches him something about life that um you can go anytime it doesn't matter if you're rich if you're poor it doesn't matter how much you have it doesn't matter if you're pretty if you're i lost a colleague three days ago and all he had was malaria so this i hope this gives prophet bushiri a different outlook on life um, we hope god gives you the fortitude you and your wife mary to bear the loss god bless you guys thank you guys for watching this episode we don't want to waste too much time i want to thank prunel for hinting us about this news it's a really sad one thank you guys please if you can go to bushiri's page please just go there and uh, Comment nice things to him and don't be harsh, don't be mean. Thank you guys. We love you.